We're told that the population P of fish in thousands, see if that makes a difference, uh, in a certain pond at time T years is modeled by this function. 1 over 1 plus 1 over P sub 0 minus 1 times e to the power of minus RT, where this is the population at time equal to 0. And R is the growth rate of the population. They tell us that P of 1 is 5. Question is, which of the following is equivalent to R? So we have to use this information and then see, rewrite this to isolate R. So if we put T equal to 1, this is P1, which we know is 5. And we substitute T equal to 1 into this expression. So 1 plus 1 over P sub 0 minus 1 to the power of e to, uh, times e to the minus r, because t is 1. So I'm going to cross-multiply this. This becomes 5 times 1 plus 1 over p0 minus 1 e to the minus r equal to 1. I'm going to distribute this. 5 plus 5 times 1 over p0 minus 1 e to the minus r is 1. So I can subtract 1. This becomes 4. So this is equal to 0. So now I think I just have to move it to the next slide. So 4 plus 5 times 1 over p0 minus 1 e to the minus r is 0. So I have to isolate this term. So I'm going to actually move this to the other side. So this would be minus on the outside 1 over p0 minus 1 times e to the minus r. And I can combine this, so this is 1 minus P0 over P0 times e to the minus R. And to take into account the minus, I'll just multiply, take this minus and multiply it to this term. So that would become 5 times P0 minus 1 over P0. So to isolate that, I mean in the exam I'll probably do it a little bit faster, skipping some steps here. Um, but I just wanted to make sure you can see all the steps. So essentially, I'm moving that up, goes to the denominator. And uh, e to the minus r is that. I take natural log on both sides. So that's for p0. Actually, what I'm going to do, maybe this is easier for you to see this. This is 1 over e to the r, which means e to the r is 5 times p sub 0 minus 1 over for p0, because... I'm just going to flip. So essentially it's like this, 1 over A, a over B is uh, 1 over X, which means X is B over A. You can just flip them. So this is X over 1. So that's kind of what I did here. And then R will be, I'll take a natural log of this expression. And if you look at the answer choices, it is indeed there. And it's answer E.